Hi folks, Jeff from Orange Acres Cars. And take a look at this beautiful 1998 GMC Suburban with that fancy golden, or I guess it's silver, chrome, whatever it is, uh, front grille on it. Man, that thing's beautiful. It's got some, some chrome running boards. I think those are aluminum so they don't rust. Let's go take a peek out of here. So you can see it's got some alloy wheels. And uh, those are real good hand-cooked tires on there. Look at the back tire there. This one's better than those ones. This one's a X uh, X radial. It's got a tow hitch on the back. It's got the tailgate with the pop-up window. And uh, look at that. I think this has got the... Uh, oh, yeah. Pops right out. Let's take a look inside a little further here. This is a uh, half ton. See those running boards on there? GMC 15 X Radial Michelins. Let's take a look now. Pop the inside of this. Got the keyless entry here. And you can see it's got a brake controller in it. It's got an AM, FM, cassette, and CD player. I don't know if CD player works, but it's missing its little... It looks like somebody had a CB radio in the top there. It doesn't have it anymore. It's got the rear air control. I think they had a sunglass holder factory there. Maybe a junkyard might be able to find you another one. You can see it's got the third seat in it as well. Uh, and as well as the middle seats. you got three seats. You can fit all your friends and that kind of stuff in there. Let's see if there's anything good to eat in there. Nope. Just that. It's got some uh, CD tray there. You can put some... Sodas in there. Where's the cup holders? Well, the cup holders are right there. They pop out. One goes that way and one goes that way. And, uh, let's fire it up, huh? Got an airbag on the passenger side. Got an airbag on the driver's side. You put this here key in there. Then turn it over and you start up. Now, where's it? What's the odometer read? Well, this is kilometers. It's got 373,000 kilometers, which is like 230,000 miles, I think. Let's see, 100 kilometers is 160, so, and that's like three, uh, 300, and it'd be more than 320, so it'd at least be 200,000. It'd be like 250, uh, let's see where 50 would be, 80, uh, 80 kilometers, uh, 50 kilometers would be 80, oh, I'm sorry, I'm doing it backwards. 50 miles an hour would be about 30. So it would be about 230,000 miles. If I'm, yeah. 230,000 miles is roughly what that translates into if you were looking at it. So this has, everything's in Celsius and, uh, uh, and every, everything else. And the voltage is going to be the same, but the, it's going to be in kilometers and in Celsius for your dash. Let me push the button here to start this. Oops, wrong one. There we go. You can see it's got the push button four wheel drive. Pops right in probably. And maybe the light doesn't work on there. But I think it all works just fine. And you get two wheel drive, four wheel drive, too high. You hear it clicking whenever it does it. That's how I know that it's doing what it's supposed to do. So I'm putting it back into two wheel drive there. Yep, here it go, click. Yeah, it's got a CD or a cassette player. Let's make sure that works. Yeah, it's got extra cigarette lighters. So you got ones for your uh, radar detector and your cell phone and your laptop. Hey, look at that. It's got the uh, that temperature is in, in, in Fahrenheit. Still, let's see if we can change that. You got a compass and you got a temperature. I don't wonder why the temperature is in Fahrenheit. It must be a button to push to change it over to from Celsius to Fahrenheit here somewhere. That button for the rear hatch. They mentioned the door chime works just fine. Let's pop the hood. Take a look at it. I believe this is a Vortec, isn't it? Yeah. Let's take a look here. Give her the old fonts. Gotta give her the fonts. Pops the hood. And there's the hood. There's the Vortec. Vortec 350. Get a little more power. Get a little better gas mileage. Used to have one of these 
things that doesn't work very good. They, they're a great filter for your engine and they make your engine last longer, but they don't, they're marketed to say that it saves you gas mileage. It doesn't save you any mileage. It, doesn't, it just filters the air before it goes back into your engine. So unless you had something majorly wrong with your engine, it was blowing oil all over your plugs, it would filter out the oil first. But uh, you probably don't have that problem anyway. We just put a new head gasket in this. This is what the problem this did, did have. Uh, we, we repaired the head gasket. Very common on a 350. Uh, really happy with the results. The mechanic did a great job on it. And, uh, oh, there's a text message down. So that means it's time for me to go. Thanks for tuning in. Orange Acres Cars. Highway 93 North in Missoula. Mile marker 13. Give us a call, 370-5466 if you want to test drive this one. I'll make sure I'm here for you. Thanks for tuning in.